Hey y'all, this is Joe from St. Bernard Acres. Uh, Gail's gonna be coming out here in a bit. There's Charlie. Charlie. <laughs> I think he's going to get on his tanning bed. He loves having the trailer sitting over there. Uh, we've got a new mower. This is the Craftsman 159cc self-propelled mower. For the last 10 or 12 years, I've bought used mowers, mowers I could fix up, and, uh, you know, it's been all right, but Gail wanted a new mower, and she wanted something self-propelled, and so we went and got one. The neat thing about this, uh, it's push-button start. I mean, it's got the pull rope. But I have, well, there's some of my Craftsman tools there. Um, it's the 20 volt max battery. That And this comes with another battery and a char another charger. Uh, so that makes about six batteries and three chargers I have now. Um, but it's going to be really easy for her to use. It's just going to be used here at the house. And it's going to come in real handy when we get the yard leveled and filled in out front. And she likes the fact that she can mow it herself. Not have to wait on somebody like me. But we're going to do an unboxing here. And I'm going to get it set up. And show you how it runs. Let Gail take it up and down a couple times and give you our thoughts on it. But it's a really nice mower. I like it. They had a whole bunch of them there on sale, but, uh, you know, a lot of them were out. <laughs> this one, I've just, we hadn't intentionally gone to get this one, but it was there, it was in stock, so we went ahead and grabbed it. But let me get, uh, let me get Gail out here and we'll start opening it up. All right. So let's see what we get here. We were probably in those, what, 15 minutes, 20 minutes? 30 minutes. Yeah, waiting on the guy that <laughs> kept giving him different ones to go look to see if they had them. But once again, that Moe's was packed beyond belief. Alright. Look in here. Well, the first thing we get, I'm going to guess it's the battery and charge. Well, since that's what it says on I the don't box, know. I'm going to go with that too. Yep, got two of these. <laughs> yep, got four of these in the good. truck here. It's got one light on it. Okay, well, we can use one of the yeah. ones out of your yeah. truck that's already charged. All right. The next thing we have is the bag. Wow, it doesn't weigh anything. There's no weight to it. But it mulches. Holy crap. Talk about cheap. No. <laughs> we'll see. And let's see. In here, we're going to have some not important, uh, you know, instructions and yeah, oh my gosh, things like want, that. We, we don't want to look at those. Hell no. That's obviously the, if you want to use the side discharge instead of the mulching capabilities. Yeah. And... Oh, this is cool. Oil. <laughs> we had a bag of oil. I'll be darned. In a bag. Never seen that before. Uh-uh. What else have we got in here? That's it. Just manuals and instructions. All right. 
And there's the mower. I think what I'm gonna do is cut this. As oh, much yeah, as, you know what? That's a it, nice box of cats. I know. As much as the cats would love this box, guess what? Well, you know what? Let me put the the film down, and I'll help you pull it out so we don't tear the box up. No, we got enough boxes for the cat. You should okay. see our living room. Once a month, I have to go through and throw 40 boxes away. You know, from all the Amazon and Walmart orders and everything. And the cats just, you know, these giant hotels we make. They don't appreciate it anymore. I know, but maybe the outside cats would. Yeah. <laughs> oh, nice. You must put an avoid in here. Yes, I did. I was going to say, look, why don't you just cut this end off? And then we'll slide it out this way, yeah. and that way the cats can still have the box. Well, I was going to cut this off and put the handle and everything on it while it's sitting up here. Oh, on the okay, truck. okay. To make it easy on me, not the cats. I'm so worried about the cats. She can care less about me. Wow, 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 wow. <laughs> Poor Joe. Yep. All right. All right, man, this sure is pretty, you know that? Model M270. Aha, that's for the catcher. catcher. Maybe that'll help it a bit. Um, so obviously. You want an instruction booklet? No, not yet. This is going to come up like so. Take these off. Get a key with it too. Well, let's try not to lose this one. Do what? So let's try not to lose this one. Yeah, let's. <laughs> okay. Alright, let me add the oil. We got the got these in finally. These you have to pick up and pull out. Because you can adjust the height, I guess, from right there. Although I'm afraid if it was all the way down, the blaze would hit it. I don't know. Let me add the bag of oil. There's none in there. I have the bag up there. This is actually pretty cool, getting a bag of oil well, like that's this. about the only good deal out of it yeah. so far. Well, it was a good deal, but... Well, it's the easiest thing you've done so far. Yeah. Besides cut the box open. Twenty ounces. I saw they had mowers up there. I think they were the ones that had Honda engines that uh, you never change the oil in. I'd never heard of such a thing. Oh. Don't say anything. I'm not saying anything. <laughs> Discard. Had some gas. Now the battery, if you'll hand me that battery, I can show how it works anyway. Around this side. The battery goes in here, like so. And that's strictly as a push button start. That's yeah. all it's for. You got it up here. That's all the battery does. When you're done with it, you pull it out, throw it on the charger. But there's a key up here. I 
guess it has to, you're gonna have to use for the start. Don't lose the key on this one. Uh, all right, let me lower this down. Let me turn that off now. Oh, we gotta clean it up. It's only brand new. All right, let's see if I can pour this gas without getting everywhere. See, it's leaking. I see. But, it's leaking in the grass. Alright. There's the new mower and the new operator. Let's see how it does on the first start. propulsion goes just take it a few feet oh I know I'm just okay uh, yeah raise it up we don't have the bag on it's just simply mulching You see, we still got to get our dirt and get it filled in. Brand new. rough all that is that's why we got to get it all level does a nice job of cutting All right, so now we'll get an honest opinion of it. What do you think of it? I think it's good. It started up good. Yep. I engaged the self-propelling thing, and is it easier than the push mower? Much easier. <laughs> well, yeah. Last night, after doing one little section back here, my arms are sore from we, that push mower. We have that old husky push mower. Yeah, that was not good. And. Uh, that thing weighs about 10 tons. Yeah, this thing just pushed. I mean, it just went. Yeah. There was really nothing to it. Even when I took it off and I, I backed, went back with it, yeah. it wasn't hard to do at all. Not well, like that other thing. I think it weighs a lot less. Yeah, I think so. And, and it uh, cut good? Yeah, it did cut good. It did a nice job. It did a nice job. So you want to keep it? Yes, I think we're going to keep it. All right. That's, a, that's the key. Yeah, we're going to keep it. All right. That's the Craftsman M270 works with the 20 volt batteries for starting yeah, but so what we're going to do oh yeah you're only using it to start, so. and it's got the well we're going to pull it out yeah you don't want to leave them sit yeah oh battery. yeah oh yeah wow. it'll start several times yeah um it's got the washout port 
So once it all cools down, we'll hook up the hose, turn the water on, start it, let it clean up the whole undercarriage, and then wash it down. And maybe next time we'll try to put the bag on it. But it mulched it perfectly. Yeah, it did a good job. There was no need for the bag. Yeah. Uh, leave any trails of anything because yeah. those weeds were tall. Oh, yeah. Uh, it didn't leave a trail of anything, yeah. so it did a good job. It knocked it down. Yeah. It's all right. We got a good one, I think. Yeah, and once we get that filled in and get some grass going, it's going to be great. Yeah. Yep, now you don't have to bother me when it's time to mow. That's right, because I can do it myself. <laughs> leave that in until we clean it. All right. Thank you, dear. This is Joe and Gail. We're out.